Okay, and we're back. I'll give you a current, quick current tour, then we'll go raid. Tower's enclosed. I was going to all glass it, but man, the work for glass. Anyways, I can't shoot out of glass walls and I it has windows on the side, and some glass, whatever that's done. I have run, I see where this wall was, the inside, I pushed it out to here with this new hunter <coughs> turn back on spawn. So they're right there and in the middle of the stream. They're in the middle of the stream and then they're over here. You can't see it. There it is. It's right there. Now I shot them, brought their body loot home, and uh, grabbed a grenade. Uh, they come there and I have run BCUs out to here so I have full power all the way out to here and a couple floodlights at night as they come down here. They'll either run back and forth here, although I had the water wall there, as you've seen. Now the water wall's out here, pretty even with this moved out. You think that's far enough away from the BCU? No. Those guys over there still attack down here, where I have, I have lights there, too. Um, I haven't had a... The grenade and grenade arrow attack, but we're waiting. When the water wall was here, one guy did get under it one day and was inside. So this inner wall stays. He was in there throwing grenades. So the wall's going from there back to here. The inside of that rock down here, out to here. I'm practically right on top of them. I was worried they were going to shoot me when I'm building this wall out to here because they're right there and they roam pretty far over here sometimes I'll hear them shooting hunting their stuff you know and I'll look and they're like right there I'm surprised they don't see me but I don't think they see you inside the wall so to get them to go home and stop spazzing along the wall I, you have to stick your, you have to stick your phys body physically outside and basically let them shoot you or shoot at you they're pretty quick and got me a couple times and then you get the base attack base is under attack message and then they they shoot some more and then they go home but not grenades and grenade arrows so that's what you want <coughs> if you restart your hunters or a new game or something where they build is going to depend then you set up for those hunters like this and then you start over and you put up and hunters come from a different direction like nobody comes from the other side you have to build to your particular hunters to thwart whatever they do like you build generically a wall X amount of feet from your BCU and then they they'll show you they'll teach you where they're gonna come in and then you reposition and reinforce those areas. It's, look at all the BC. That's all the further you can reach with a BCU. So this million BCUs. And then I have to have lights to see my way out to the wall. So I have spotlights showing me the way at night. Because with my settings it is absolutely pitch black at night. I can't see at all. But that's not satisfactory. Uh, the BCU reaches only that far. I have to put another one. That, we need a, a relay panel, light poles and wire or something to run power around. This is long overdue. Uh, that wall out there, and that water wall has stayed. I don't have hunters on that side, so we'll see. Okay, okay I'll quit yakking. They can't get up this rock. It's a good way to get out and uh, and also battle them. I can battle them from here. These are <coughs> up on a half wall, so my barrel just I'm well covered to just stick it out here. And there's a light on each side. They won't go into attack mode. They'll just spaz along that wall. I'll have to engage them and send them home. This keeps them out. 
believe it or not. They can't get up this, but I can. That's just extra in case. I, now, all this building I haven't raided in a long time. It's been a lot of days, so it should be good loot. Watch, it won't be now. See, they got solar panels. <coughs> Maybe they have a workbench now. Last time I raided, neither one of them did. I got empty zero loot from these guys in the stream because I was always killing them. So I let them grow. What's that on the patio? Oh, they got, that's the one that has the chair on the patio. The second floor patio. Maybe they'll have a workbench now. But I got a zero loot raid from them. Last time. And I used a grenade. Uh, you, got, you got about a 50. Look at that chicken. You want to see a chicken get blown to bits? He can use an arrow on these, you know. He's stuck on it. <laughs> oh, look, the arrow disappeared because it hit the, the bird. Well, I'll get this one back. A claymore doesn't. But it disappears if you hit the bird. Okay, right. No way to jump in there. So you got a 50% chance or more uh, with the grenade going through the steps. And uh, I stopped. It seemed to be worse when I would go up here and drop it. So I threw the last one. Wish me luck on this one. I've gotten the the range and the throw down pretty good. No, that wasn't good. That was down on the third step, but it didn't go through. 272. Okay, I'll come back when I'm through. See what we get. Okay, we're back. You know, I did time chopping a wall, uh, a door, and it's four and a half minutes. Um, so I use one grenade and chop the rest. What the hell? Oh, it did hurt. The steps are down to 504. Um, grenades cost twice the gunpowder they should and do half the damage they should. So cutting half the gunpowder to about from 55, is it, to like 20 for a grenade CG. And then... Um, make them do twice as much damage because even my best throw or drop only gets the door down to 260 or 262. I've never gotten any better than 260. Never. This better be good loot. <sighs> Nails and copper, huh? No rifle rounds. Four. You got 30 slots here. I'm I'm always saying the same thing, so you know what I'm going to say. This is, this is a lot of crap. That's crap. And I didn't even get my grenade back. If I do get, on the rare chance that I do get a grenade, I get one. And I used one. So you guys are like, well, you used two grenade arrows. Or you, used two you don't get it back. Gunpowder and ammo is at a premium. You know that. I don't need the copper. You guys are all saying we need copper because you're making ammo. You can't find it. That's right. <laughs> ammo is not enough. Or the gunpowder to make it. See, I'm low on rifle. You stay that way. And you got two hunters. How many shots each? If you're perfect shot. And rogues and retaliatory raids. Have you ever watched these hunters shooting an animal? They keep shooting it like several times each after it's dead. It's kind of funny. Or if it kills, because sometimes it'll kill them and they go over and get their stuff. Okay, so that was crap. No, nothing good. What's good loot? <laughs> 
the three bars is good loot. I don't need cloth to you. I don't need nine millimeter to you. So what I get? Nothing. It's got to be a reward, man. All right, I see some crates. I will take this home and then go out. Oh, getting late. Maybe I better get him some stuff now while I'm out. I've been building, so I lost. So I've gone way down in stuff like blueberries and fibers. You got to be collecting those every day for a fire and vegetables. If you have chickens, they eat all your tomatoes, unless you grow a thousand. So, and that's so much work. You don't have time for anything else. I currently don't have a chicken. I have one occasionally. I got 20 some eggs in the fridge. I won't have to get a chicken again for a while. Thank God. I hate them. Look at all the BCUs. See? <laughs> Something else. So we come along this wall. This is as close as you can get. But doing this puts BCUs this close to the wall. So they're going to come attack your BCU. They're going to come right here and attack this one. See, I can get up there, no problem. When they were at the water wall here, I couldn't get them to get the base attack message until I came here. So I put this wall up because as soon as I would step, which is like into their view, I guess, on the other side of this wall, the, from the rocks, uh, even though I'd show myself to them and get shot at and exchange fire or whatever, I could never get the base attack message. And I found out that I, if I come in here, and this is all I had to do, immediately, heavy fire, zapping me multiple times, and get the base attack message don't ask me why so now we'll see what happens when the wall is out there I haven't been raiding so I haven't been getting attacked well I did I did spark off in it uh, attack and then they went home here but they haven't come to the water wall yet maybe these guys will come down random attack and we'll see how this works maybe I'll film that for you all right there it is. See, I had armor over there. I had armored those walls. When I had a base over there, that's where they would always come. And then they used to attack by water, where that wall is. Shoot grenade arrows from underwater at the tower, BCU. You can't. So I have. This grew from just a cabin, unarmored cabin. No hunters, just subsisting and enjoying life on the lake to all this. The lake tower, the inside wall it started with. Now we're all the way around. We got this second tower. And I moved this out three or four times. I can't even remember. So we're basically right in their face. I mean, I can't move out anymore. Uh, they'll see me. They're right there. I let this one go just because it's silly. They're always in the water. They should have a lot of fish. They should have... I'll raid them tomorrow and see what I get. Alright, I'm going to get out of here. This isn't so long to upload. From subsistence. Day 466. See ya.